For the educated holdover browns of the Farmington River, midges and blue-winged olives are a staple forage. An old-timer might even advise you to rig a merger patterns when the fishing gets tough. But what happens when the sun sets and most fishermen go home? Is it possible that an old fish could let his guard down? And would that fish be aggressive enough to eat a mouse crossing the river? These are the questions that we're going to try to answer in this video. The only dangers are not hitting each other in the eye with the fly, bears, and beavers. So I had a run in with like a 50 pounder and you know what spot I was in too. Yeah. Oh shit. look at that beaver. Holy shit. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's a big boy. It's no joke, yeah. dude. All right, so we just got to the spot. We're waiting for it to get dark. And what kind of water I'm fishing will dictate my retrieve. In this slack water, usually they hit it when you pause it. If I'm fishing faster water, I'll do a more aggressive retrieve. The reason why you're doing that is because you're competing with the riffles. You want that fish to be able to see where your fly is. Absolutely smoked it, like as soon as that shit hit the water. It's a strong fella right there. Awesome, man. Dude, yes sir, yes sir, come out, come out, come on. Small strips, Yeah. like three small strips real quick. Yeah. Let it pause like your boy told me, and he hammered it. Beautiful fish, let's get him back in. Yes there sir. I'm there too. Do you think we should go hit that again now, or do you think we should wait, keep hitting some new spots? Wait and come back at the end. What do you think so far? Uh, the first spot had great potential, and the second spot was a bust. What do you see right there, right on that trail? That's a mouse. Mouse right on the trail, guys. There it is. Look, he's not even running off. He looks stunned by it. Oh my goodness. Oh, Look dude, you got the shot now. Kind of looks like my fly. <laughs> Maybe I should put a white on, though. He had a white belly to him. It is on again, dude. Oh my goodness. All right, that's a better one. 17, 18. Yeah, all nice. day. And it's fat, too. Nice kite male. Oh my goodness. Hey, guys, this is why I eat mouse. This is the same pattern that I'm throwing. It's a master splinter with a white belly with a tra little teaser hook. You guys want to see how to tie this, go ahead and like this video. I'm sure you're gonna see probably only one or two catches from last night, but just if you need any indication of how much action and how many blow ups I've had, just look at this fly. This fly was brand new when I tied it on yesterday. That's the only thing I hate is that like, they're f like I could see my dry fly and then they, sh they jump like a foot away from it. It's like... This dude wanted to come down and fish the river. He's used to fishing, you know, petting zoos. And what happened when you got to the river, Seas? You see any fish? They're jumping all over the place, yeah. We get any? Not yet. Yeah, that's the problem. Keyword, yeah. Yet. These fish, they're smart, man. Keyword is yet. We'll come back when it's dark. Yeah, and we're gonna meet him at the spot at eight o'clock. This river will humble you, straight up. It will humble you. And it's frustrating when you get to the river and you see hundreds of fish rising. All those rises. Yeah, <laughs> like they're feeding. They just don't want what you're selling. And it's frustrating, but most people don't fish at night. Most people fish with flies this big. We're fishing with flies this big at night. Going for size today. Yes, sir. Nice. Oh. Wow. Beautiful fish. Can you see it? Yeah. Turn it sideways a little bit. Like the head towards me. There you go. Nice fish. I can't see. Don't worry some. Yeah! Once, you know, every uh, little pop pop action. Here, hold it next up. Next thing you know, you got him on. I think it's past your bedtime, bro, after that commentary. Yo. <laughs> dude, I'm a slip. Look at that sucker. It's not a bad one, dude. It's my first Farmington that's a, one. Yeah, I'll take that's him. your first one, and it came on a mouse. It's not a bad fish. I'll take him. All right, we put him back or what? Yeah. Nice. They're not gonna see our mouse in this. Yeah. Oh shit. This is crazy.
Yeah, guys, I think that's it for tonight. Right now, we're doing rock, paper, scissors, shoot to see who gets what spot. All right, there's a... There's, <laughs> we don't upper, have to say anything upper, else. That's it. The upper and the lower right, spot. The, best so. out of three? Best so out of best three. out of three for lower spot. Okay, here All it right, is. ready? Rock, paper, scissors, shoot. Rock, paper, scissors, shoot. Gotcha. Rock, paper, scissors, shoot. Fuck. <laughs> okay, best ah, out of three. Come on, dude. Come on. Rock, paper, scissors, shoot. All right, boys. Us. Good I'll luck. <laughs> it's a gnarly rainbow. Look at that. A blue heron went for it. Gosh, look at that. And he smoked the mouse, too. That's crazy. All right. Yeah, I got off to a slow start, but five minutes just hooked up twice, switching up my retrieve. I'm using a black mouse tonight. That's black synthetic hair. He smoked it. Ah. Nice. Oh, yeah. Beautiful. Fish. Hit it hard, too. Oh, yeah. Crushed it. Beautiful fish. Nice Did you fish. set the hook or strip set it, or was strip it just set there? It, yep, yep. Just strip set it. I don't Gorgeous have the fish. patience to do that. He's been moving. Look at that wow. fish. That's a wow. 20 all day. 1920? <laughs> Wild as hell. Yeah, look up. Dude, sick. Look at this fish. Oh my goodness. Oh, that that is a tank. <laughs> Not many anglers see the value of fly fishing mice at night. Not many trout have what it takes to eat a mouse that's crossing the river. But an apex predator that doesn't understand fear will rise for a mouse the same way that it would for a BWO or a winter summer caddis. For that reason, we venture out of our comfort zone and into the darkness. <laughs>